Say hello to my little friend. Guys and gals, today we're here to take a look at the Antlion Audio Mod Mic Wireless. This thing in front of my face. Um, so, I was sent this across by them, so full disclosure, I was sent this product for free, but it is not paid promotion, and I can tell you what I think about it. So if I thought it was trash, I would tell you that. Luckily, I don't think it's trash. Antlion Audio sent me across this and they asked me to take a look at it for the channel. Um, I did tell them that if I liked it then I would make a review on it and here we are because, well, quite frankly, I did like it. Um, it's a cool little piece of tech, nice and easy, probably along the easier audio solutions I would say, especially if you're um, new to recording or anything like that, then I feel like this is a pretty good solution for most people that are getting into recording. Um, so, impressions out of the way. No, 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 let's not do that first. Let's take a sweet little look at some B-roll while I tell you all about this product, shall we? Okay, roll the B-roll and sassy music. So the Mod Mic Wireless offers you a full band audio quality with crystal clear audios for your ears. Aptex low latency, which is about five times faster than Bluetooth, 12 hour plus battery, and a built-in mute, which is, you know, Handy. It has three LEDs built into the side of it so that you can see when it's connected, connecting or muted. Uh, and also it has the same ones built into the dongles. Um, inside the sweet little carry case that you get, uh, you get the a USB extension cord, the charging cord, some gumph with writing in it, and you get, of course, the mod mic itself with the dongle. So here it is, this is the mod mic, and um, it also has a little switch here that allows you to pick the different polar patterns that it picks up. Um, so you can either do omni or omnidirectional audio. So the audio files out there will know what I mean. Um, personally, I found that clicking it toward your face is the best setting, um, in my opinion. The other one didn't sound quite as good and as clear in uh, in my testing. Um, I've been testing this quite a bit, actually. Um, mostly, I've been testing this when I've been on console or my PS5, whenever I'm playing Warzone or whatever. Boop, slap this bad boy on. And to be honest with you, it's been pretty golden for me. Um, set it up couldn't be easier just grab the magnet that is self-adhesive give the surface a little wipe slap this on there slap the mod mic on and you're pretty much good to go at that point it's connected nice and simple nice and easy and uh, not too stressful as i've said i uh, and you've probably seen that little b-roll clip there literally i've been testing out the majority on my playstation 5 headset the mic quality on here is okay it's not great so it's nice to have a little bit of an upgrade and um i feel like it's been the best for it like I say, click clack, nice and easy. Uh, it couldn't really be any easier. You can also, it has like little ridges built into the magnet so that you can just snap it up, have it out of the way if you've got it muted. Don't have something dangling in front of your face. Boink, and you're good to go. Uh, the one thing I would definitely say is don't have it here. Don't chew on the microphone. Because honestly, it doesn't give for a good sound. I personally found a little bit further away from the face leaves like a clearer audio. Um, I wouldn't say it's the best sounding audio I've ever heard in my life, but I would say that it is very, very amicable for doing stuff like online gaming and stuff like that. The other thing that I think a lot of creators are using this for, especially like early creators, are using this for uh, recording in VR because it's quite easy to, again, stick that magnet onto something like your Quest um, and then you can just stick your magnet onto that and then you're good to go you've got your wireless microphone built in that's better quality than what the quest has because let's be honest with you the quest you know doesn't have great audio um but even if you're using like pc vr or something it's quite a good solution to the issue of not wanting to have wires running around you um i had used things like wired lav mics back in the day and um, you know, quite a few times I have trodden on the cable and yoinked that thing off, i.e. killing the video or destroying the microphone, which has happened. I replaced it like three times because I trod on it in blade and sorcery or something and snapped it in half. Good times. Like I say, setup's pretty darn easy with this thing. You plug your dongle in. It does come with an adapter as well, like a lengthening cord that you can plug this into. Um, this does need to have some sort of direct line of sight with you and your microphone. Um, so they've already supplied a longer lead for that, which is pretty easy to get set up. Personally, I had no issues with, with like actually connecting it whatsoever. That wasn't an issue at all for me. Um, it does have the little LEDs built into this as well, because obviously it's somewhat pointless having LEDs on the side of your head because you can't 
can't see the side of your head unless you have like a omnidirectional eyeball that I, I don't think you do so you, it's probably useless um <laughs> so it is useful to have it on the little dongle because you can see whether you've clicked mute or whatever make sure you haven't left yourself muted and you're like brah that guy over there go get him go get him why aren't you going to get him R revive me what why haven't you oh that's because you're muted bro Silly. But yeah, I have to say, pretty simple. Like I say, especially with setting up with the PlayStation 5, I had no issues whatsoever. Clicked it into like my little dongle of things because you know they don't ever put enough USBs and stuff anymore. So clicked it into a dongle, select it as the Antlion Audio. Antlion? Why do I say it weirdly? Antlion Audio Mod Mic. Boop. Select that setting and you're good to go. It just recognized it, picked it up. Not a problem at all. Same with the PC, plugged it in. Pretty much picked it up straight away, then you select that as you use a microphone, not a problem at all. Easy to do in OBS, easy to do in anything else. Um, I have found that in my testing, in fact I'll show you some testing now, this is my audio with it. This is a test, a test to see that you can test if I test, 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 test the microphone because I'm testing it. One, two, three, four, five. Now for a more extreme test. Ah! Oh my god, he's over there! I'm down! Save me! Quickly, I've marked him! Get him! Oh my god, there's a guy over there! Woohoo! We won! Oh no, I'm dead! Ugh! I feel like that's probably gonna cover all eventualities of gaming. <laughs> Tell me you've ever seen a test like that on the internet. Okay, over to other Reese. So my current setup for recording, just to be completely honest with you and straight, is a wireless lav mic that I use. Um, it's a very high-end lav mic. Um, will this replace it? For me personally, probably not, but that's not a quality issue or anything like that. It's just that I have a solution that I have that is preferred at the moment. But do I recommend this? 100% yes. Um, it's a little bit pricey, I'll be honest with you. It is a little bit pricey. I mean, I know I didn't pay for it, but you, you guys, when you order them, would have to. Um, but yeah, I do think it's a bloody good solution, and I feel like it's a very good fix as well, especially for console players. Uh, I really feel like that is the real market for something like this, because built-in mics are never very good. Um, I feel like this gives me a much better quality. Um, if I'm recording or anything off of my PS5, this is a very good solution. And um, I definitely think for creators like VR creators, real nice. Super easy to get set up, super easy and functional to just get going get recording and begin your content creation journey without too much complication because although I've said that I use like a lav mic and stuff like that honestly it's not a very easy thing to get set up it's not a very easy thing to get the best quality out of the audio it takes a little bit of experience takes a little bit of audio knowledge whereas something like this it, it truly is like a bit of a plug-and-play experience where you can just get going so like I say I 100% definitely do recommend this although it won't be my solution for every single day use um, other than the console so that's kind of a lie actually it will be my solution for everyday use in certain scenarios will I be using it for my audio and my videos probably not <laughs> <laughs> but like I say, in all honesty, I have to say I'm very, very impressed with this product. Thank you very much to them for sending me one out. I do really appreciate being able to take a look at stuff like this. And thank you for you guys because you voted and wanted to actually see this video get made. So I hope it's answered some of your questions. What I have done down below is left a couple of links to be able to pick this up. One for the US store and one for the UK store on Amazon. Um, because you can order it nice and easily like that. Not too much of an issue. Um, and yeah nice and easy i hope you have enjoyed this video if you do have any questions then please feel free to ask them down below um i just think that it definitely has its place in society um and it definitely has its place on the market as a good quality solution at not too ridiculous of a price I don't review stuff very often on this channel, but I tend to only review the stuff that I actually care about and or I find functional and useful for you guys, you know? So that's why we've taken a little look at this bad boy today. Um, I'll see you in the next one. Like and subscribe. I'll see you then. Bye to bye. Hi, I'm Chad Mosby. You might recognize me from...
Not much. Don't do it like this because you'll sound like an idiot. <laughs> Bye.